Hey, yo, what's poppin' y'all? It's your boy, My Shine. You already know what it is. We at the Dynasty Records studio. Make sure you go get Dorm Room Music dropping May 1st. Right now, you're watching Urban Compass TV. Yeah. with Urban Compass TV. Today, I'm here at our studios. I'm about to go interview recording artist, My Shine. I might get in the booth, maybe not. But before all of that singing, I'm going to talk to him about his music and his new EP, Dorm Room Music. Can you keep a secret? We out on this floor, dancing our freaking, running real slow. I know what you think. My shine, how are you doing today? I'm wonderful. How are you doing, Jack? I'm good. Thank you. So we first seen you on the TV show, Lincoln Heights. How was it going from an actor to a recording artist? A lot of people don't know this, but I actually started off as a recording artist and got into acting and continued to do music. So uh, I've been doing music since I was 10 years old. I've um, been with the same team, Dynasty Records, and uh, just, just been grinding. You know, uh, Lincoln Heights was kind of like, um, I wouldn't say... It was a bad thing, but it was actually an incredible experience that I had. Uh, something I decided to break off and do entertainment-wise. And um, I did that for five years. Mm -hmm. And so uh, I finally got my chance to come back and come back to my first passion, which is music. And uh, that's that's what I'm doing right now, doing room music. I'm glad we got to see both sides of my shine as far as the acting and the performing. When you were a child, did you always think you wanted to be a performer? Right. Honestly, I, um, I've been singing my entire life. Uh, I grew up singing in the school choir from second grade on, and I think um, kind of those experiences for me were really the ones that solidified my um, confidence in what my craft is and what my talent is. So I've always been a singer, so you know, there's no doubt about that. But um, as far as being an entertainer, you know, it was, it was, a, it was a growth type of thing, you know. Um, it was just going from 10 years old, not really knowing anything about the music industry or performances or, you know what I'm saying, all of that to really having to learn it all myself. And, um, you know, that's, that's where, I'm, where I'm at right now. You know, I write, uh, I produce, I engineer myself a lot of times. Um, I pretty much learn to do it all and it's actually out of the passion for what my first love is, music. You know what I mean? So. I definitely think if you have a passion for something, then that's going to take you really far with, with what you love. When we first got a taste of My Shine, you were 16, and you gave us songs like Just a Kiss and Turn It Up. How are the songs on your new EP, Dormer Music, different from the songs you gave us a couple years ago? The songs I gave you a couple years ago depicted where I was at. Mm -hmm. um, obviously, Just a Kiss, Just a Kiss, you know, it's an incredible song, but now I have songs like... Um, 24 hours or I have songs like Victoria's Secrets which is the single off of Dorm Room Music and so I really feel like these songs express who I am and where I'm at right now you know what I mean Dorm Room Music is an incredible album I put a lot of passion behind it and uh, I actually got to take the driver's seat um, on this one this is my first album that I actually ever put out uh, I put out a couple mixtapes but for the most part it's just been songs songs leaks singles or whatever this is the first album that I got to sit back take driver's seat and really visualize how I wanted it to be and um, I really feel like that's gonna show that's gonna come across on the album and people are really gonna get that from me when I when I sat down and made the album I really the first thing I said was I really want people to get who I am I want them to understand my voice understand what I'm saying and uh, we got that across for sure so I'm pretty sure they're gonna like the album 
When um, are you having an album release for Dormy Music? The album release will be on May 1st at the Microsoft uh, store in the Lenox Mall. And it's going to be crazy. It's on Tuesday. Please come out. Um, live performance, uh, new music, um, maybe even some stuff that's not even on the EP. Maybe it's just some exclusive stuff. Um, giveaways, you know, the works. It's just going to be a lot of fun, so make sure you come through. Okay, so not only are you a singer, you're an actor, you're a performer, you're a dancer, you play the guitar, the piano. What are some hidden talents uh, that My Shine has that no one knows about? Hmm. Well, you kind of put a lot of them out there just I know, now. <laughs> I know. Um, some hidden talents that I have. <sighs> what do I know how to do that nobody knows that I know how to do? It could be something goofy, crazy. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I don't know if I'm that goofy. I play basketball. If a lot of people don't know, I play basketball. Um, I think I look like a basketball player. I'm like 6'1", so if you see You're definitely tall. You know, it's, it's, it was good, you know what I'm saying? People be trying to challenge me, but it's like, really? Really, dude? <laughs> Let's hop on the court. So if people want to hear more from my shine, as far as like show dates, download your music, where can they contact you at? You can contact me at myshine.net. That's M-I-S-H-O-N.net. Hit me on Twitter at myshine. That's M-I-S-H-O-N. Same thing. Facebook, M-I-S-H-O-N. My last question for you is, will my shine follow Urban Compass TV on Twitter? You already know it. Okay, guys. If you want to hear more from my shine, follow him on Twitter at myshine. And, of course, make sure you go to his album release party on May 1st at the Microsoft Store in Lenox Mall. For all my Urban Compass seekers, Subscribe us on YouTube, follow us on Twitter, add us on Facebook, and of course, follow me, Miss J09. Flowers don't mean nothing anymore. All those gifts and all my love letters, you've thrown them out the door. Even when I try, I end up sleeping on the floor. I guess an absence doesn't make the heart grow fonder anymore. So I can't say I'm not impressed with you I'm not ready to invest I can't say I'm not the girl for you I just might not be a girl